Welcome back, MPI, to another edition of MPI Tech Support. Today, we're going to be showing you how to import footage from a mini DV camera. Let's get started. All right, so the first thing you need to have is a FireWire cable. Uh, you can find them in a tech center, or you can just ask one of the tech teachers. Second thing you need to have is a power cable for your DV importer, which is this. So the first thing you're going to do is connect the FireWire cable into the FireWire port into your computer. Now you have to be careful here because the type of FireWire cable that you have is a 800 FireWire cable. And the other one on the left is a 400 FireWire uh, port. So make sure you connect it into the right one. Second thing you're going to do is to connect the other end of your FireWire cable into your TV importer. Step 3 is easy. You just take out the tape from your camera. In order to do that, just press the eject button. And then your camera would automatically take your tape out. Alright, the next step is to power your DV importer. In order to do this, you just plug in uh, the power cable into the outlet and another into the DV importer. Alright, so the last physical step you need to take is to turn on your DV importer. And then press the eject button in order to put in your tape inside the DV importer. In order to do this, you just put in the tape into the tape recorder, and push it down, and then your in the DV importer will automatically take it in. Alright, so now we're back to the computer. First thing you need to do is to launch iMovie. And then when you turn on your DV importer, iMovie will automatically launch your importer up. Now, automatic would uh, rewind your tape and import everything. So that's why you need to change the manual. Now, if you press the play button, you can see where your tape is at. Now, if you don't want to import from here, then you could just press the re rewind button until you see the point where you want to import from. So let's say you want to import from around here. So you press the stop button and you press the import button. And then it gives you an option to either add an existing event or create a new one. For the sake of this video, we're just going to create a new one. All right, and the DV importer will automatically start playing your tape. Um, and iMovie would start importing your video. Let's say that's it. You just press the stop button and iMovie will automatically import all of your footage until that point. If you go to me and if you're having troubles in that way, I can shoot it into Moodle for you. So you go like, what do I do next? Just shoot it to me and I'll be glad. And <laughs> All right, so now you're set. And if the DV importer doesn't start playing when you press import on iMovie, then you could just uh, press start on your DV importer. All right, thanks for watching.